be using. Uh, needless to say, the Aquafollies is no longer. Part two of the art of stair climbing. I know some of you had some questions about stair climbing, about knees, about posture, position, going up and down. So I'm gonna address those today and just make stair climbing just as easy as possible with less wear and tear on your knees and making stair climbing fun. As with all things life athlete, there's an easier way to do things physically, being in your body, and there's a harder way of doing things. I've done a lot of the harder, so I'm gonna share with you what I found to be the easier way getting the most out of stair climbing, so here we go. Okay, I think the first thing that people have a hard time understanding with going up and down stairs is where does the body need to be positioned to gain the most power out of your body, but also not to hurt your knees. That's where most people have problems. So let me show you. When you're going up a stair, now this is a very uh, large step, but it doesn't matter. I wanna be over my foot so that my head is over my toe. And from doing that, I'm pushing from my glutes. And I'm really thinking about not pushing and not using my knee. I know that's a little odd, but that's what you're trying to do. Use the big mover here. This guy is a lot weaker than this. This is a lot stronger than your ankle. So you wanna use the biggest part, the center of your body first. So lean forward and then step up. Lean forward, then step up. You'll notice that if you do this right here, if you push your knee forward as you lean back, you feel your knee. I feel my knee right there. There's like compression, discomfort, low grade discomfort is pain. So you don't wanna go there, you don't wanna push through that. So if I lean back and step up, I feel my knee. If I lean forward, drive from my hip with weight in my heat, in the heel is also meaning that you lean forward. So there's opposite energies going on there. Okay, if you're here, less so, okay? So here, drive up, not here, ouch, hurts my knee. That's first. Okay, I've got some smaller steps here. I'm gonna show you the position. Just, just do a few ups and, and back down. So the correct way, here, here, here. You're running the steps. Boom, 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 boom. Always driving from your hips. Again, not doing this. I feel my knees. You don't want to feel your knees. If you do, don't push through any joint pain. Don't do it. I've done it. I've been there. It takes a long time to heal. Don't push through joint pain. Okay. Now, it's really tricky. When you're coming down the steps, that's where most people in day-to-day -day life, when they're walking down steps, that's when they feel their knee. And there's a reason. The more your knee is in front of your body, the more you feel your knee. If I'm like this, I feel my knee a lot. When you walk down step, I'm leaning back. I'm leaning back because if I lean forward, I feel like I'm gonna fall down the step. So that's natural, but here's the way to do it. If you have knee problems, you may not have knee problems being totally upright, that's okay. But if you do, you need to lean forward a little bit more. Let me show you. You simply, do this. I'm leaning forward going up and I'm leaning forward going down. Now I'm using my I'm using my hips to slow me down going down the steps and again I'm sparing my knee. Now, initially it may feel a little bit awkward to do that but it's pretty easy over a course of time and take a wider stance more like this less like this that makes it easy. How's that? Give that a try. And that's the way you get the most out of stair climbing. Walking or running or even jumping. Just remember guys, being in your body is a treat. It's a gift. And taking care of it and optimizing your potential of being in that body for all stages of life is what Life Athlete is about. I'm sharing with you what's been taught to me by some great legendary coaches and what I've discovered on my own to make being in your body more safe, uh, greater sustainability in terms of performance, and you just feel better, so you enjoy it more. And remember, it doesn't 
have to be hard to be good. Life athlete, do less, be more. Don't forget to hydrate.